To create a new scenario, navigate to the Scenario Builder screen. Tap New Scenario. Then provide a scenario name and description to help you remember what the scenario will contain. Create a new step, tap into it to start editing, and choose a duration. In our example, we choose a duration of 2 minutes. So any vital sign changes drawn will take place over 2 minutes. Select any waveforms you want to be activated at the start of this step. Waveform changes always take place at the start of a step. Next, select any parameters that you want to change during the scenario. Tap the parameter to activate drawing mode. While in drawing mode, the y-axis show the value of the selected parameter, and the x-axis is time. Tap once to draw a single line across, in our example, a heart rate of 100 is set, and doesn't change, throughout this step. Systolic and diastolic values are also specified. To have a value change over time, simply tap the parameter to enter drawing mode, then draw the required value change. In our example, heart rate increases from 70 to 140, over 1 minute, then remains at 140 for the rest of the step. Build your scenario by adding additional steps. You can also duplicate an existing step to quickly continue from the previously created step. Draw any parameter changes, and select any waveforms you want to activate in this step. Rename the step with a descriptive title, for easy selection later. Drag the SFX or Investigations icons onto the timeline, to have a sound effect play, or Investigations to appear at this time. Select any investigations you'd like, you can select multiple images, labs, your analysis or notes to appear. Here, our investigations appear at the start of the step. Drag the tile to change the time they appear at. If you have lots of scenarios that you want to organize, use folders. Create a new folder and rename it. Press down and drag your scenario to the folder to move it. Your folders along with any scenarios you create are automatically synchronized with your cloud account for use on any of your logged in devices.